Hello, I'm Serena Chowdhury with BBC World News. Our top stories. Pro-democracy campaigners remain on Hong Kong streets as the territory's leader warns them to end their protests by Monday. The parents of the American hostage Peter Kasich appeal to Islamic State militants to show mercy and release him. Welcome. There's been sporadic clashes between police and protesters in Hong Kong in the early hours of Sunday. You've been getting a lot of um, sadness and, and different, you know, people really saying that they're heartbroken by these attacks. But there's also been some criticism of local media in Pakistan. So local television stations right at the beginning of the attack a couple of hours ago were showing children and they were interviewing children. And there's been a lot of people that have been coming on social media and saying that how could you interview these children when they're in such a state of trauma? There's been rising discontent amongst Sunni Arabs in Iraq, particularly in the west of the country. You know, they actually set up an anti-government protest camp. Now, in April this year, we saw a clampdown by officials on that camp. There were some casualties. And as a result, there's been growing anger amongst Sunnis, particularly because they feel that the current government in Iraq, which is a Shia-led government, is marginalizing them. Up here in the world's newsroom, we've been talking about the social phenomenon that is Indian Prime Minister's social media strategy. He's one of the most followed politicians across social media platforms like Facebook and Twitter. I have with me here my BBC Hindi colleague Vandana and we've been taking a look at a bit of his strategy. The state of Assam has a long history of sectarian bloodshed and armed groups fighting for autonomy or secession. It lies in India's northeast, bordered by China, Myanmar, Bhutan and Bangladesh. Well, you can get plenty more stories on our website, that's bbc.com forward slash news. Thank you for watching the program. I'll see you soon.